Let's have a look at how Fonterra can use the new property module to view, manage and export property information. We're looking to collate some information on drainage rights for the Mangaturu Dairy Factory in Kaipara. Well our journey begins in the new local maps gallery. And here you can see Fonterra using a number of the new version 3 gallery features. Up the top we see a temporary banner configured to link to an information page. And then we've got a hero image with an overlay gradient and text. And then above the category filter section, we can see some text with help information. And then if we scroll down to the bottom, we've also got some copyright information. We've got access to tools for viewing and editing property information, as well as links to dashboards and external tools. And all of these are secured, as you can see from the lock in the bottom left hand corner of the cards. Well, let's have a look at the property viewer. <coughs> First, we'll search for the property we're interested in finding out more information about. We know the address, so let's just use that. And well, as, you can, as you'll see, in our map, we have access to both our own editable property information and also Lynn's property information. So we'll select this area and then click through to the underlying title pop-up, our property module entry point. As you can see, we can click through to see information on the selected title, or we can go in through any spatially related address highlighted on the map when we hover. Here we can see the parcel associated with this address and all titles associated with this parcel. And we can also go off and see all memorials associated with each. Of these titles. There's only one parcel associated with this address and if we hover over the titles and the parcels we can see the parcel and title occupy the same area. So let's use the query tool to see all of the Fonterra owned titles in this area. We've got a range of different queries we can use. We can query title information and parcel information. And we can even query non-spatial information. We can query all 30 million memorials across the whole country and then we can go off and find related spatial features. But in this case, we just want to search for title owners. Once we've done that, we can click on a title to open up the property module. And then we can go back to view another title. You can see in this result that there's two parcels associated with this main title. And we can hover over each of these to see the location of the parcel highlighted on the map. If we click on one, the map zooms to the parcel. And then if we go back, we'll return to the main view. If we expand the memorials, we can see here that there's several memorials which are related to our wastewater rights. So let's export the data on memorials to help with our historic property research. Next, we'd like to...